What's going on guys? Beastly Gamer here. Welcome welcome to the channel. Today we're going to talk about 2016. It's behind us now. Uh, it was a great year for gaming guys. Uh, PlayStation 4, 50 million units sold. Of course Xbox One did really well as, as well, but Microsoft doesn't really talk about what they've sold because they don't like to be looked at as the loser. You might be surprised to find out who was actually the king when it came to the internet. Who was the most talked about console? Who was the most exciting console? Who was the most Googled console? I'll drop a link in the description. No consolation. Nintendo Switch powers past the Xbox One and PS4 to become the king of the internet 2016. Searches for Nintendo products were more than the Xbox One and PS4 combined by the end of the year according to research. Huge numbers of fans searching for Nintendo products such as the Switch, Pokemon Go, and the Nintendo Classic Mini NES has meant the Japanese company has dominated the internet this year. By the end of the year, internet searches for Nintendo were more than the Xbox One and PS4 combined, according to research carried out by Similar Web. The company told the website GamesBeat, quote, The growth of Nintendo's search traffic over 2016 is so big that when comparing its search traffic to November 2016 to January 2016, it multiplied its search traffic by a factor of 60. In January 2016, we were able to identify a total of 39 keywords generating traffic for the brand." End quote. Earlier this month, the brand new Nintendo Switch made its television debut on The Tonight Show in America. Host Jimmy Fallon was joined by the firm's American president Reggie fils to play the Switch's most anticipated game, The Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild. The game console is due to be released in March. fils demonstrated the Switch's big selling point and inspiration for its name, its ability to be both a console that can play a game at home on the big screen and a handheld on the go. You simply slide the console, which is basically a 6 inch tablet, out of its dock and it will transition into a handheld mode. Games will be stored on cartridges like the Nintendo and the Super Nintendo. I'm not surprised by this news guys. I think that the Nintendo Switch was an epic uh, reveal of 2016. Of course it was initially referred to as the code name NX. Uh, everybody thought it was just a home, a home based console and a handheld device. They would be separately released. Everybody thought that the handheld was going to come out first, and then the home console, and then you have to combine the two. And to me, that would have been a horrible idea. And then we finally saw this thing. It's just one very unique experience. It's a console that plugs up to your TV, and then you slide the, the handheld screen out of the dock, the tablet, attach the controllers, and it works perfectly. I think it's a beautiful console. I think what it can do is going to change the game. And I'm really not surprised that Nintendo dominated the internet. The classic Nintendo Mini was just huge all over the internet. It was one of the biggest Christmas gifts of the year. Uh, I think the Switch was really huge. And of course, Pokemon Go was one of the biggest portable games of the year. It was a huge mobile game. And people are still playing it and enjoying it. I think 2017 is going to be just as big. I think that the Super Nintendo Mini is going to capture the hearts and minds of lots of old school gamers like myself. And I think the Switch is going to just be phenomenal. It's going to be really, really incredible when we see what this thing can do in a couple of days at Nintendo's press conference. You guys let me know what you think in the comments below. Who was your winner of the year? What happened in 2016 that got you the most excited? Was it getting a PlayStation 4? Was it PlayStation VR? Was it getting the Xbox One S? Was it the revelation of the Nintendo Switch? What had you most amped in 2016? What was your king of the internet? Let me know in the comments below. Be sure to give a thumbs up, show support for the channel, join the Facebook group, follow me on Twitter, and you can support the channel at BeastlyGamer.com. I'm the Beastly Gamer, and I'll see you guys next time. Take off.